Hello YouTube, tonight I'm going to be showing you how to get songs from your iPod to your PC and um, if you have tried this before uh, you know that you can't do it. Uh, right now I got my iPod connected to my computer and I purchased some songs um, on my iPod from the built-in iTunes app and I just downloaded them from there and nothing went through my computer. So uh, to get the songs that you purchased on your iPod uh, to your computer so they'll show up here you have to download a, a program called pod to pc uh, which you can get at pod to pc dot com um, and then you just go to the download tab up here and click on download and this is going to be in a winrar so you're going to need something that extracts um, things so just right click and extract here and you should get the setup. Now I already set it up and everything so I'm gonna go ahead and delete that and now once it's set up you should get a shortcut on your desktop like this so just go ahead and open it up and make sure you have iTunes running. Um, if anything pops up in iTunes just hit ignore or something like that. Alright so just wait till this loads up. Alright so this is not a free program you do have to register it but it lets you use it um, as many times as you want but it's just gonna keep popping up and telling you to register it but just hit OK and that should go away now here you should see your iPod and everything uh, all the information and then you wanna go to here music and video and stuff like that um, if it shows a check mark that means that it's already on your iTunes and that you don't need to transfer it but um, the ones with nothing on there that means that you don't have it in your iTunes library or your computer so what you want to do is check all the songs that are not on your uh, iTunes and then just go to uh, you can either uh, leave it at the main folder which is uh, your iTunes media folder or you can change it to whatever you want I'm just gonna go ahead and select desktop and this will come up just hit OK alright now it's set to the desktop and hit OK now that means that uh, the music is going to go into your desktop so once you've done uh, choosing the songs and everything that you want just go ahead and click on transfer and now it's going to transfer the song from your iPod to your computer and now you can see that was very quickly and uh, it tells you uh, like a little log thing here uh, one iPod track was transferred to your computer successfully and zero failed to transfer so this will come up you can just exit it now um, yeah just, it'll exit by itself in this many seconds just leave it there but anyways now your um, your song should be on your computer uh, it should appear in a folder um, separated by the artist and the album uh, you can now delete the folder and you should get the song onto your computer just you can play it back to see if it works and yeah it worked and it's great quality it's it doesn't reduce the quality at all it's just copying the song from your iPod to your computer now you can put it onto iTunes and you can see it lets you put it uh, anywhere you want here in any folder and just to show you that this wasn't sort of like a useless thing, useless tutorial. Uh, you can see here, this is the iPod connected. And if I go to music, or uh, let's just say purchased. These are songs that I purchased on my iPhone, I mean my iPod. And um, got it straight from the iTunes app. So they downloaded it from through Wi-Fi to my iPod straight. So I'm going to try to put this song onto here and it doesn't let me for whatever reason so if you ever wanted to do that to get songs off your iPod or iPhone to your computer that's the way to do it so if this tutorial helped you please rate comment and subscribe and goodbye